Relations between the Somali National Army and African Union peacekeepers appear to be at an all-time low. This time, it is not the Somalis who are being criticized. SNA Commander General Odawa Yusuf Rage has called Burundian troops under Amisom command lazy. He addressed his complaints in a letter to the African Union head of mission, Francisco Madera. The July 4th document says about Amisom forces, they do not want to help us in the fight against Al-Shabaab. General Odawa is specifically upset about not getting support for a recent offensive against the terror group in Middle Shabele. The operation was generally a success, with about 100 Al-Shabaab operatives killed and dozens captured. The assault also destroyed enemy bases and secured strategic towns. But the SNA forces accomplished their goals without help from Amazon. General Odawa had a heated exchange with Burundian Lieutenant General Diomedes de Gea. The Amazon force commander accused his Somali counterpart of planning and executing the mission on his own. De Gea says that when the Somali troops appeared to be in some trouble, General Odawa asked for assistance. The Somali commander paints a picture of cowardice, saying that the Burundian troops are afraid to clear roadways of Al-Shabaab. He says they fly 13 kilometers by helicopter to fetch water rather than risk a fight. It is the first major criticism of Amazon by Somali security officials. There have been outside observers who have faulted the AU peacekeepers for strategic failures and even corruption. In the past, the Somali military has been accused of a lack of professionalism and also corruption. The AU mission's mandate expires at the end of the year. An African Union panel recently suggested four courses of action. Three of them reshaped their engagement and in one, Amazon pulls all 22,000 soldiers out unilaterally. The Somali government has expressed dissatisfaction with the options in the report. ADN TV will continue to update you on security developments in Somalia and throughout the African continent.